Nothing good comes easy. That's a cliche, but it's really the truth. Nothing good comes easy. And you need to be out there. You need to be persistent. And with persistence, certainly you're going to get good results. So just keep working. VC for Africa meetups are open workshop events. Although informal in nature, everyone's encouraged to actively participate with a contribution or opinion. You're openly encouraged to share information and real world experiences, both at the gathering and later on through your own networks. Huge market potential for your idea. It works in Cameroon, it works in Nigeria, it works in all of these other countries because you've tapped into a need. These conversations were captured at a recent VC for Africa gathering in Buya, the capital of the southwestern region of Cameroon. The town's located on the eastern slopes of Mount Cameroon, and that explains the nickname that tech entrepreneurs have given the area. So people started calling this Silicon Valley, but we said, no, we're not in the valley. We're rather in, around close to the foot of Mount Fako, so we should call this Silicon Mountain. That's how the name was dubbed. VC for Africa founders Ben White and Bill Zimmerman were on hand for the kickoff series of events. Both bring extensive experience of doing business in Africa, but are keen to point out that every meeting has a different local focus. Yeah, hi, my name is uh, Bill Zimmerman. I'm uh, originally from Seattle, Washington. I've spent uh, a lot of time here in Cameroon, uh, going on more than four years. Something about the environment here in Boya, I think it's kind of the right mix of uh, having the, the University of Boya, the only Anglophone university in the, in the country, is a, is a big factor. And you can't just manufacture a Silicon Valley or a tech hub or something. It's, 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 uh, you have to, the right conditions have to be there and I think it needs the right mix of people and, and, uh, and, and Boya is kind of uh, special that way. The workshop today was um, really on business, how to design a business model by the use of business, a business canvas. Um, I would say it's pretty, pretty much been a very good um, learning opportunity for most of the entrepreneurs at Active Spaces. You know, Active Spaces is a technological tech, tech hub for young entrepreneurs. So we learned quite a lot and for me particularly, I've always known that designing a business plan is really an ad hoc idea without um, any pattern. But from the workshop today, I've come to realize that there's actually a pattern that even makes use of both sides of your brain, the left side and the right side. I mean, I was personally inspired by a lot of the stories and a lot of the, the young people uh, that, that are not afraid to sort of put their signboard out and call themselves a CEO and, and launch a technology company. I think that takes a lot of, a lot of courage. Just right now, I was discussing with um, another member of, of VC for Africa, and we were, compl we were complaining that um, there, there is something uh, missing here in Cameroon and, or in Central Africa. We don't have the culture of entrepreneurship, we don't have the culture of um, investment with venture capitalism or business angels. So definitely we don't have the culture of um, the new world economy and that's a problem. So we were thinking about how we can build, build this culture, how we can develop it, how we can ignite it. And VC for Africa is the kind of community we need to, I mean, yes, to take this spirit to a new level. I'm a real estate broker and I had an idea which needed a technological platform which I couldn't develop myself. So I came here and I met a whole group of techies and two of them, you know, they're really interested in this project and they decided to work on it with me. And it's, it's been five months and um, we're nearing the end of the road, you know, as, as far as our work here goes and uh, pretty soon we'll be launching uh, uh, our project. And uh, I, in the time I've been here, I've seen, I've seen a whole, uh, bunch of other people come in here you know they're really interested and they're excited that in Cameroon you know you have these young people with ideas coming together and trying to make things happen it's uh, I, I think it's it's revolutionary it's something that hasn't been seen before well we came to Cameroon because uh, we have actually quite an extensive network here of entrepreneurs and investors and as VC for Africa we wanted to meet these people in person 
So uh, we came down to uh, Douala and uh, spent time in uh, Boya and Limbe. Uh, tonight I, I talked to uh, a couple of uh, entrepreneurs who are uh, very interested in the energy sector, uh, looking at water uh, as a key area for a, a lot of uh, potential business. I've talked to guys setting up uh, outsourcing businesses. Uh, and then we have this amazing tech community, uh, a lot of uh, young entrepreneurs coming up and, and looking at how they can use technology to set up companies. Uh, so you really see a, a wide variety of, of businesses that people are trying to set up here in the country and, and that's really promising. On the other side, you see uh, a number of individuals who are looking for uh, qualified uh, business plans. Uh, we have a couple of bankers with us this evening, uh, a couple of individuals who are actually in the process of setting up their own investment funds. Um, and so really it's a nice opportunity to try and connect these two. It's very difficult to find online platforms that uh, try to connect entrepreneurs with investors for free. That's one beautiful thing about the platform. And it attracts a lot of visitors for that same fact and we've seen a lot of quality ventures from Africans, a lot of things that are surprising people, not not too many people know that there are these capabilities in Africa and this platform is a really big showcase for that. These meetings seem to work because they encourage conversation and there's no hierarchy. You can talk to everyone, whether they've just started or been in business for years. It's your chance to discuss a business plan and get honest feedback on how to find investors. And don't forget to build a profile on the website vcforafrica.biz. For the conversation has only just started at a VC for Africa meeting.